Hi, I'm Nora, and today I'm going thrifting with my sister and my sister's best friend, Leia. I slept with this curler in, so I don't know how she looks. Oh, oh, no. I'm done with my makeup. I don't have time to fix my fucking hair, but the outfit I'm wearing is very like 40s inspired and i gotta go now before heading to the thrift store i want to talk about some of the things i'm hoping to find one an everyday skirt that's preferably dark in color so black gray or even purple i'm not really picky with fabrics and i usually like flowier skirts better two some gothic jewelry that fits in with my everyday set Three, I'm hoping to round out my DVD collection by picking up some movies that I've recently started liking or some that I've grown up watching. It's really quiet in here. I don't know if I can film in here at all. Did you just ask me if I wanted to get married to you? Not to me. What? <gasps> Oh my gosh. This, this dress, oh my gosh. The, look, are you, do you see this? The front of it? It looks like it's from the 80s. Look at this one. This is so ugly. It's a rain boot with a heel. Why do I kind of like this jacket? I have one of these. Kate gave it to me for Christmas. I'm not even joking. She's right here in my closet. She is the exact same thing. <laughs> so Leia, did you steal somebody's dog? Uh, no. I sat down and was kind of looking at the chair and this old lady came by and asked if I could watch her dog while she goes to the bathroom. Who would want this in their house? So I got this and this and this. A little mimic. <gasps> with, That's so cool. With yeah, tiny little dice in it. You might be wondering why am I seeing her stupid face again? It's because I'm about to go thrifting again. Why? Because I haven't been able to stop thinking about that fucking wedding dress all week. Nora, you're not getting married. Nora, you don't even have a boyfriend. Nora, what are you doing? Yes, is this financially stupid? Uh-huh. But I just can't stop thinking about it. So we're gonna go and then hopefully pick up the wedding dress if it's still there. If it's not there, I'm, I might cry a little in the car, but it's not the end of the world. So excited to show you this haul. I have never been more happy and completely stunned by what I've thrifted before in my life. So on Sunday, I went out with my dad, my sister, and her best friend, Leia. I got this gorgeous, like black rosary almost style necklace and it doesn't have anything. And I did have to, I ended up having to shorten it because this bottom chain was way too long and was going down to like almost my belly button which that just might be because of my short torso but it's gorgeous okay i found this black christmas sweater well it's a more of a winter sweater but it's a winter sweater vest i was picturing it with a turtleneck and a long skirt specifically a red turtleneck to match the penguin scarves and I just thought that this would be so cute for Christmas Day because you would not believe how hard it is to find a Christmas sweater that is actually dark or not red and green. That same day, I went to Goodwill and I found this gorgeous, long, flowy 90s, like Sabrina the Teenage Witch, like halloweeny kind of vibe skirt and is the most comfortable like this is going to be my daily skirt now hear me out when i show you this i was watching youtube with my dad and leia the morning before we went thrifting literally the morning before and we were watching a youtube video called like 
toys people have forgotten or toys people don't really buy anymore and one of them was Raggedy Ann and Raggedy Andy and I'm like oh my gosh I always wanted those dolls I love those dolls and what did I find at the thrift store but Raggedy Andy I'm sorry he is a little bit naked I am gonna have to make him his own clothes he was a dollar and fifty cents <laughs> I got this, which I've been looking for Sleepy Hollow on disc, but I love this. I've always really liked the gigantic box TVs with the VHS player, and I've always really wanted one in my bedroom, but I think that it would be better if I wait until I move out to do that, but a nice start to my collection. So I found this. Natalie, again, please don't watch this. I found this. Alrighty. Alrighty. I found this. I love Beetlejuice. She loves Beetlejuice. I found this and all I could think was, man, I really wish that there was a second one that I could give to Natalie. Or man, I really wish that there was a Sleepy Hollow one so that I could, we could both have our favorite Tim Burton movies. So there's this shelf and I've looked over it like twice and then I see in the like bottom corner. So I crouch down like an idiot in public and I crouch down and I look and all I see is this. So I see it, I pick it up, and it's my favorite movie. So I got her favorite movie and my favorite movie. I'm gonna display mine. I'm gonna give hers to her for Christmas, maybe. I know while I'm editing, I'm gonna insert a clip of me actually wearing it, but I just thought I'd show you it all up close. It's got these beautiful dangly beads all over it the sleeves do i need a wedding dress right now no but is this bringing me so much joy yes oh my gosh i love it and i got it for guess how much guess how much money you're not gonna believe it twenty dollars twenty dollars twenty dollars this was twenty dollars but then i get up to the counter they scan it in sales tax 80 bucks the discount my mom grabbed my arm in shock. I was frozen. The poor lady behind the counter had no clue what was wrong with us, but I was just in shock. This dress is beautiful. It's perfect. And I got it for $20. I've spent more on shoes at Goodwill than I have on this dress. Now I just have to find somebody to marry. So... If anybody wants to marry me, hit me up in the comments. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I really, really hope you enjoyed this. Please leave a comment down below. What is your favorite thing that I thrifted? I really hope you enjoyed this video. Sorry there wasn't much footage in an actual thrift store. I only went to two different thrift stores and one of them is very quiet. One was a Goodwill, which we went on a Saturday. I had a woman literally like tailgating me through the skirt section and getting mad at me when I was like, okay, I'm leaving. Took the skirt that I wanted and left. She got mad at me. Girl, you're obviously trying to find something in this aisle. I don't need to be here, okay? Thank you so much for watching and goodbye.